Hi, I'm going to show you how to record audio on your computer, save it to your Google Drive, and insert it into slides. So the first thing we're going to do is go to the Chrome Web Store and search for Cloud Audio Recorder. When you find it, you need to add it to Chrome. Now I can see this on my Chrome apps, or I can just go to the website. So what I'm going to do is just save the link to it so I can visit the website when I need to. Save it. Okay, this is a, an app that works on the web. It's not on your computer. It's recording things to either download or save to your drive. But saving to drive makes it really easy to put things inside of Google Drive or into Classroom. So first what I'm going to do is click Start. Hi, I'm recording some audio. I'm going to put this into a Google Slideshow. I'm going to stop it. You can pause and, and restart it if you're in the middle of something, but I'm just going to stop it here. I am going to export it as an MP3. That's good for using in Google Drive. I can play here if I want to listen to what I have. Hi, I'm recording some audio. I'm going to put this into a Google Slideshow. Okay, sounds good. I am not going to save it to my computer. I'm going to save it to my Google Drive. Here it's going to ask me to put it in my Google Drive and where I want to put it in my Google Drive. First, I'm going to rename it Test Audio. And I'm going to select the folder I want to save it to in my Google Drive. I have to sign in with my Google Drive the first time. After that, it will just open up my Google Drive automatically. I'm going to save this to a folder called Audio Files and save to Google Drive. I'm going to go look at it in the folder. Here in the folder, I can see it's Test Audio here at the bottom. And there's something important I need to do before I put it in a Google Slideshow. I am going to right click and I am going to click Share. Everything that you put in a Google Slideshow needs to be shared if other people are going to listen to it or look at it. So I am going to say anyone on the internet with this link can view. If I need to change that here, I can change that to a particular person or a group or just anyone on the internet. And I'm going to click Done. Now I'm back in the presentation and I want to add my video. Now I'm back in the presentation and I want to add my audio. I'm going to add a slide. Put my name. There's the assignment. And here I'm going to add my audio. I'm going to go up here to Insert and Insert Audio. It's going to let me search my Google Drive. It's actually going to automatically bring up the last thing I recorded, which is handy. But if you don't do that, you can go here to the search box and just search for it. This is the one that I want, though. Test Audio. I'm going to select it. Here it is. It's this little microphone thing down here. I am going to make it bigger by dragging the corners. I can move it to wherever I want it. And I'm going to change the color of it. I've got the format options open over here. I'm going to recolor it pink so it's easy to see. I can test it by just clicking on it and clicking the play button. Hi, I'm recording some audio. Yep, that sounds perfect. I can get rid of that text box if I don't need it. Now I've got my slide with my audio added.